Hi folks, Dustiny here. Thanks for stopping by RVSalesOregon.com to take a look at this pretty much brand new 2019, slightly used. It was titled, but other than that, this thing's in the wrapper. 263 BHXL. It is a bunkhouse model. Starting here, you've got full pass-through storage. You've got that nice laminate one-piece hardwood look-alike, so it's all water resistant. You got uh, the retract and extend um, electric jacks all the way around. You got solar prep on this thing, electric tongue jack with a light up here on the front. You got the larger extra capacity battery if you want to go with two big ones or two small ones, you can do that as well. This is all set to go with low levelers as well, so it's got the clamps already here on the tongue. They sell these in this area brand new for considerably more, so uh, considering uh, what this is, uh, 2019, we don't see these very often. Normally it would be an 18 or a 17, but Taking in a 19 on trade, uh, people, I guess, just decided to go with the motorhome, went a different direction. So full pass through up front, saved thousands on this, folks. Got the Schwintec slide out system here on the big super slide. That's a dinette and a sofa sleeper slide. Schwintec's about as good as it gets. Got a one piece rubber roof up there. Outside hot and cold shower. You got your black and gray tank out here. 30 amp power cord retracts out of the sidewall. You got uh, the upgraded water heater on this. You've got the storage uh, gate. This actually folds down. You can put bikes and things like that on top of this when it's flipped down. You can store your sewer hose in this bumper here. It's a radius crowned roof, which is good. It rains in Oregon and this, uh, the Northwest, I guess they call it. So you want the water to roll off, not sit up there on a flat roof. Um, You've got uh, a double door entry on this actually. So your main entry is up in the front. Uh, this is access, just an extra door here to get into the bedroom. Again, you got jacks all the way around. So all, um, all electric four point leveling jacks. You got the upgraded tires on this. It's all six lug. Larger furnace. Um, going on up inside here, you got the solid step, which is great. Doesn't have the lesser expensive step that breaks and the welds crack and creates a lot of rattles and noise and people get hurt so we don't want that you've got upgraded equipment on this trailer you got the nice solid surface countertop in here again the laminate wood look like floor the bunkhouse probably the nicest attribute to this trailer in the rear this is a perfect rig for a family of four or six or larger yeah, you could take it uh, to football games great tailgater lots of space either use those for sleeping or you could use it for storage check out that bathroom so you got full access here, your own door to get in and out. If you just want to use the bathroom and then get the heck out of here so it doesn't, you know, dirty up the rest of the trailer. Nice big bathroom, toilet. You got the full dinette that folds down here. This will sleep two persons if need be on this, on this nice oversized horseshoe dinette. The sofa pulls out, lays flat, and this is all leather. You got the nice uh, spot here if you want to put a big flat screen TV here. Lots of storage all the way around. Tons of storage. And then uh, going on in the bedroom here, you can take a look. You got a full walk around queen bed. You got dual sliders on both sides. So those just open right up. And you check out the nice uh, walk around queen bed here. Shelving up here, closet on both sides. So you kind of got the best of both worlds with this trailer and you're under 30 foot long. You got a 26 foot house on this thing. Gas electric refrigerator. And this pantry, check out this pantry for a 26 foot trailer. This is a great. So yeah, this pretty much has all the attributes, oversized, three burner, sealed off stove, gas cooktop, oven down below, so you can bake, you can use the microwave up here for things, but lots of storage for your, you know, your utensils and things like that. It's got it all lined out there, and then it's all ball bearing guides and things like that for your drawers. Uh, it's got ducted air conditioning, all of the extras and more. If you got any more questions on this or you want to know more information, I know it's horrible. You got to ask for Dustin so we can pick up where we left off. Uh, just ask for me. Uh, you can phone in uh, at the number listed on uh, the screen there or you can drop me an email. Uh, whatever works best for you. We will pick up where we left off and we can work out some kind of deal for a trade or a no trade discount. See if we can't help you out a little bit more. You just got to ask for me. I know it. Um, but enjoy the rest of your day. Thanks for stopping by, folks.